So we have to expand the question 3x minus 2y or multiplying 3x plus 2y. If you can solve a question like this, what you're going to do is first note that these two terms are in one bracket and then these two terms are also in one bracket. This means that the numbers in this bracket are to be multiplied by all the numbers in this bracket. So what we will do is when you take one term from this bracket, you multiply it by each term in this bracket. And then you come here, you take this term, multiply it by each term in this bracket. Let's do that. So we take 3x, we multiply it by the entire terms in this bracket, which is 3x plus 2y. Now you come and take this negative 2y2, you multiply it by 3x plus 2y. Okay, now that you are done, you take the 3x multiplied by each term. So 3 multiply 3 gives 9. And then x multiply x gives what? x squared. So we have 9x squared. 3 multiply 2, that is positive 2. So that one gives you what? Positive 6. And then x multiply y gives what? x, y. Now you come to this side. Negative 2 multiply 3 gives what? Negative 6. y multiply x gives x, y. And then we have negative 2 multiply positive 2 and that one gives what? Negative 4. And then we have y multiply y which gives y squared. So this becomes the expanded form of this question. Now that you are done, you can now group like terms and then add or subtract only like terms. So we have 9 x squared, 6 x y, minus 6 x y, and then negative 4 y squared. So you see that 6 x y and then 6 x y are alike. Okay, they are the like terms. Unfortunately for you, they are already well arranged. So you just solve it right away. So we have 9 x squared. And then this is 6xy minus 6xy. So this one becomes 0, right? Good. And then it's left with 4y squared, which is negative. So you write your negative 4y squared. So this becomes the answer for the expand and then simplify the question 3x minus 2y or multiplying 3x plus 2y. So which of the options do you think is correct? The option is what? A. 9x squared minus 4y squared. If this is your first time of reaching this channel, press the subscription button, subscribe, and then press the notification bell so that you will be updated on any new videos. You can click the channel name there to go through the playlist to watch more of these tutorials on Q&A.